Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Brant Fowler, and I'm ready to talk to you about only good comics. This time, we are talking about The Sacrificers, issues number one through two. Uh, this is by Rick Remender, Max Fiamara, and uh, Dave McCaig. And this series from Image, it's kind of a slower building series, but these first two issues have really pulled me into this world and have got me really intrigued by what's happening with these characters and, and what their journey is. So basically the Sacrificers starts off with this family of anthropomorphic pigeons uh, or birds, some kind of bird-like creatures. And it's a family in a little farmhouse, but they have this son that, that he's not allowed to sit with them. He's you know kept out in the barn uh, and it's time for the sacrifice. So the, the these people and, and these you know, kind of crazy outfits show up with a bunch of other uh, young people and stuff tied to a, to a rope and everything or chained up and everything, and they come to, to collect him as well. The family's all sad about it, uh, except for dad, the pop, the papa. He's just like, you know, and I think the, the, uh, the impression we were supposed to derive from that was that it was easier for him to be cruel to the kid and like kind of lock him away and not have to face uh, letting his son go. But at the at that moment, he was you know even he got sad about it, and uh, that's kind of how we left issue one off was him leaving and being sacrificed in some way to to make peace with the gods or whatever. We don't really know exactly at this point, uh, but it it got. All of us on comic book really curious like what's gonna happen to this guy what you know where is he going why is he being sacrificed all this stuff so come issue two this week um we see their journey he's with a bunch of other people and they've all been sacrificed some of them feel like it's their their holy duty uh they are uh they're being taken to a land of paradise and and they've been chosen and others uh, who have kind of lived in squalor their whole lives uh, have a completely different vibe. Some of them think they're going to be thrown into a volcano. Some some of them think they're going to be fed to beasts, uh, you know, tortured, whatever. Uh, but none of them really know what happens to them when they get to wherever they're going. And they're, they're uh, for lack of a better term, they're guards. They're, they're the people that are kind of bringing them along on this path they're not very kind or very forthcoming they're very cruel throwing them in sacks uh beating them over the head you know doing whatever they can and only uh a few of them have actually brought provisions uh one I, some some kind of creature and some of them are human uh i don't know what kind of creature that was it may be some kind of sea creature or something um she had lived a life of plenty so she had a lot of food Whereas our guy that we introduced to the, in the first issue only had like the stale piece of bread that his little sister or little brother, I can't remember, I think it was his sister, uh, gave him. And a lot of them had nothing. And so she shared her food and they all were like digging in and everything. But we still don't know where these people are going, right? So we're fearing the worst. It's called the Sacrificers. So obviously they're going to be sacrificing something. But what are they sacrificing exactly? And by the end of this issue, we see possibly where they're headed and what their life may entail beforehand. And it's not what you might expect. And this is a minor spoiler or a big spoiler because it is the, uh, the cliffhanger that we're left on. So if you have not read issue two yet, uh, pause here, come back, and then uh, we'll talk about it some more. If you have read issue two already, you know what's happening. Let's go ahead and talk about that right now. So... They are thrown into bags or hoods over their head, whatever it was. And when they're opened up, they're before a seeming paradise. Flowers everywhere, waterfalls, you know, food galore, all that stuff. And that's how we end issue two. So now we're led to believe, oh, maybe they were taken to the promised land because they have to become this high council that governs the people and that's the sacrifice that they're making whereas it could be a red herring 
this is to fatten them up to kind of get them comfortable before the next stage i don't know we you know you've seen stuff where people are sacrificed it can go either way we don't know which one this is yet and given that it's rick remender here writing this i'm sure there's more to it than that and we're going to find this out slowly uh, again, it is a, a slower build. Uh, it's a more, you know, kind of deliberate pacing to this book, but it's definitely got me intrigued. Uh, I can't say overall this is a fantastic series. You gotta, because we're only two issues in. I don't know how long this is. If it's an ongoing, it's Rick Remitter, so it's no telling. So I, I really don't know yet if if by the end of this I'm gonna still have this on this channel but as of right now issues one and two this is a recommended series for me uh, go check it out the sacrificers if you like long form storytelling you like that issue to issue just a tiny little bit of cliffhanger and eventually we're going to get to a big payoff uh, that kind of story you're going to enjoy this uh, it's got a bit of mystery to it a bit of sadness uh, these are you know relatable characters in here uh, so it you know it's got a lot Lots of love and a lot of room to grow. Uh, so I definitely recommend checking this one out. This is The Sacrificers from Image Comics. So that is going to do it for this video, though. So definitely hit that subscribe and notification bell so you don't miss any content going up on this channel. Follow me across social media at Only Good Comics. And find this YouTube channel by typing in OnlyGoodComics.com. And until next time, thanks for watching. I'll join you next time for more good comics. Until then, take care and keep reading. Bye.